Hey. Hi. Hi, 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 hi. Welcome to episode 15 of this Alan Wake Let's Play. I'm Jackson Tyler of AbnormalMapping.com. Last time we failed this fight, this time we will win the fight. If you are not on board with this Let's Play already, it's pointless of me trying to catch you up because my word... It's been, it's been nonsense. And trying to explain the story of Alan Wake is a futile effort. And it's been a good, it's been fun. It's not just, just been shitty. Like, the game's not great or anything, but... You know what I mean? Fuck off. Alright, they all came from this direction, right, next time? Shut up. Damn it, I was... Ah, I thought the flashbang would work. Okay, well... Here we go. This fight is difficult. Maybe I'll just use the flash, lift the flare, when they come at me. Because these first ones are really easy to take out. I'm gonna give Pastor Howard a piece of my mind about this lock. Uh, I told him to get it fixed. Here they come. Here we go. This is the most this is the least interesting encounter design they possibly could be doing though, which is um, a series of places you need to get to and short closed off areas of violence as you traverse space. On some level I don't know how to make uh, the end game of uh, the, 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 the final stretch of a video game, interesting. In, in terms of a game like this, it's like a shooter or an action game. Because with how they structure the narrative, uh, at some point it, the ending becomes entirely about you know, reaching the end as quickly as possible. Uh, the stakes are raised high and there's a sense of urgency that there isn't earlier on in the game which gives you time in the early game to explore the combat system and soak that all up. Right. There is a Good, we're done. But yeah, um, in those games, in the games where you like, uh, the end of the game is you have to get okay, through. It's, open. Let's it's go all about wait. the energy, uh, the difficult, and also the difficulty is usually increasing. And they want to be mechanically challenging you with the things you've learned. Uh, I'm talking in a traditional sense like your big AA games or whatever. I'll get back to that after this, reading this. For it to be free, the Dark Presence needed the writer to finish the story. Again and again, the story let it get frustratingly close to the writer without letting it capture him. It was bound by the events depicted in the manuscript. But it could pursue the writer indirectly, put others on the task, and stop those who would help him. It took over everything in its path, made them its puppets, and sent them after Alan Wake. But yeah, I'm trying to think of a game, We're almost there. We'll an action the game of some description, that has a really yeah. good There's no way going end stretch. The will turn out to be a bad idea. Uh, Bayonetta does. But Bayonetta's whole thing is do a thing and engage in combat to see what the next ridiculous thing and the balance is better there is. It's the same loop of fight someone, get to the next story moment, but the fighting... And seeing what the fights are and the context that you're going through are 
in more interesting. This is dark. Got him. Good job, Sarah. What else is around here? No, it's just a thermos. I don't care about those. Um, so there we go. Oh, I feel like the frame rate is really low in this bit. Oh, here we go. I did not. Guess that one saw the light. Hey, Barry. You didn't like that one? A tough audience. <laughs> well, I got plenty more. What? What are the Christmas lights for? What do you think? Protection, man. Like garlic against vampires. Oh, Barry, you're great. Vampires. The helicopter's just across the parking lot and up the hill. Come on. I like my crew. I got a good crew. Good crew are we. The Bright Falls General Store is now my favorite place in the entire world. I, I, is it? This headlamp? It's like a superpower. I can just look at one of those things and they die. It's my flaming eye of Mordor. I like it when people have to say Mordor. Say oh, good, good. Oh, this hey, game's great. I want a headlamp. Last one. Bastard. Alice had screamed until she had no voice left to scream. Around her, the darkness was alive. It was cold and wet and malevolent and without end. She was a prisoner, trapped in the dark place. The terror would have burned her mind out, but one thing made her hang on. She could sense Alan in the dark. She could hear him. She could see the words he was writing as flickering shadows. He sensed her too. He was trying to work his way to her. Let's see if we can get to each other. Yeah, I like the dynamic of the gang that has formed. I like Barry a lot. I'm glad Barry's been in this late game stuff way better. Uh, the story's got a good tone to it. I'm glad it's picked up in the way it has. Someone throws a damn school bus at your head and you're about to take a helicopter ride with someone who may or may not have a pilot's license. You're cleared for departure to Night Springs. See? Uh, no offense, Sheriff. He's great. But, uh, when I was tweeting about I was playing Alan Wake, and I said some iffy thoughts on the opening of that game, because I think that game, the game opens really poorly. I don't think it's a strong start. Everybody shine the light on him. Cool. Yeah. And I said the thing, and I said that oh, Alan Wake's not a great character, and he's an arsehole and everything. And they said, oh, by the end of that game, I thought everyone was pretty likable, and I was pretty much scoffing at that. But I think they've actually done a really good job of sticking to their guns and telling their story. It's been interesting enough. The helicopter's just up ahead. I'll need a while to prep for takeoff. Don't uh, take too long. I want to get out of here. And the game has issues, like the combat focuses way too much. I'm, I've... I've Helps a lot that we're playing on easy. This is a large area, so frame rate's going down a little. Well, here we go. Bam, bam, bam. Fuck yourself off. Oh. 
How did that not take you out? Well, that went poorly. That went very poorly. Let's do that again. Uh, yes, I know. I know there are indirect means of. Oh, come on! Uh, the checkpoint in this game isn't very good, I'll say that much. Can I at least set up? I've got a flashbang. Oh, I'm stuck now. Okay, well, here we go. First off, that's already it's already gone bad. Uh, right, let's just give me some space. Turn on the lights. Well, this is going badly. Where are you? Oh, it's only one of them. There. Birds? What's happening? Oh, Pumbo just shot them. Let's take out all these guys. Oh, wrong gun. Great. Wait for the flare gun. I was not paying attention there. I uh, may have heard my phone go. Uh, just like random, completely meaningless thing, didn't turn off the thing. I'm not very professional, but that's okay. I think I do good stuff. Cool. Fly me. Just turn this one on. And turn this one back on as well. Cool. This side next. Where do we go now? I mean, as much as I deride these um, arena shooting sequences, this one's fine. This one has tension. Uh, this one has an interesting setting. I don't hate it. Okay, going.
I'm glad the assault doesn't end. I'm glad you just have to get to the helicopter. That's the right way to do it. These people have watched their movies. Just get me a weaver, Sheriff. You're taking a big chance on a local crazy lady, Al. I hope you're right about her, or we can kiss this town goodbye. I'm gonna be right about her. Don't worry. I think this will be fine. I hope you know how to deal with this wake. I guess you New Yorkers are used to rough situations like this. Ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba. Uh, the city's a war zone. King Kong, mutant alligators. Then Alex Casey shoots the place up every weekend. Look, I never even carried a gun until a couple of days ago. Well, my dad used to be a cop there. Tells some pretty wild stories. Stuff like this? No, no. Just normal bad stuff. Kind of like your books, Wake. I used to tease dad that he was just like Alex Casey. Aww. You've read me. Oh, sure. You're a pretty good writer. A little heavy on the metaphors, maybe. Aww. Nobody's ever said that before. We're coming up on the power plant. See the lit building over there? And that's the dam further up the river. I can't land here. I'll take her down the road across the river. Just get me there, Sheriff. Drop me off and we're gonna go. We're just here. Oh, they're just destroying the birds with their light. That's good. Alright, what do I do now? Do I still have my items? Nope. Well, if I knew that, I would have been way more. Okay. The darkness controls the Taken. Where do I go? God, this lamp is crap. I don't have a gun, do I? Let me in, let me in, let me in. I guess it's not gonna. Where do I go then? I'm lost. I really am quite lost. Do I take out all the birds? Something about the chain for the door to open. Yes, I know. I don't have a gun to shoot the chain. Do I let the birds try to attack it? Do I just stand here and... Why I don't know? Quite sneak. Hmm. Well, this is ridiculous. This is taking back all the positive things I said about the game. Well done. In here? Oh, here's the gun. Good. I just need to find a gun. Okay. I like my revolver. There we go. Oh, I am just trapped right now. Well done. Right. 
Let's head in here. But let's head back. Get this guy out first. Oh, he's gonna come behind him. There'll be someone coming to the to my left in a second. Oh no, he came right. He turned right. Yeah. We're stocking up on things in here. Yeah, we are. There, we're loaded now. You know, if you're going to just stock everyone up before the next bit, why let... Oh, no. I'm a hoarder of items anyway. I'll always hoard. Rather than use what I have. As you can tell in that like, final fight last time, in the in the drive, like I used a bunch of items, but nowhere near as much as I could have. Shoot! I see the thing. Bam. Oh, that was pretty good. That was a good move. Go on the left, go on the left, go on the left. Hold him at bay. Um. Fuck. Fuck. Nope. I thought I could. All I want to do is hit that thing and it would explode and everything would be good, but alas, it was uh, not to be. Right, let's head through again. Oh, I got him. Where's the guy? Where's the guy? Well, I'm dead. Well, hmm, hmm. Let's keep going. Um, is there any more stuff I could take? No. Um, Roger 
dead, dead, dead. dead. Oh, come on. Okay, good. Phew. It's an exhausting fight. Oh, there's ammo in here. Good, thank God. Let's head on. Head on our way. Oh, new checkpoint. Perfect. I didn't want to fight that again. But here's the transforming yard. It was close, but I had to find a way across. You will, Al, you will. <laughs> Here we go. Well, is there anything around there? Yeah, there's something around there. Is there any pickup around there? A single flashbang. Okay, we're not very stacked, but we'll keep going. I just need a better flashlight than the one I have. Oh no, we can't go that way. I understand now. I see what we have to do. Go down here. Let's turn this off. Or on, even. Checkpoint reached. I have to go. Oh, most of these. Well, okay. Anyone around? No, just this bad guy. Cool. Um, and then here's the manuscript page. Yeah. Making her way through the water pipe alone, Cynthia was angry at the writer. Foolish young man taking unnecessary risks and the way he broke the rules didn't he understand what was at stake since the terrible days in the 70s she hadn't wavered once as hard as it had been she was tired of protecting the town all these long years and now only wanted to rest cool oh well, we'll see her soon we'll reach out with her and see what's going on oh checkpoint good 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 Okay, it will be fine. There's a guy behind me and to the right, so that's... Shit. Oh shit, I thought 
Thought I had it. Thought I had it. You know what? You know what? I was going to end it when we exited the Transformer Yard, but no, we'll exit the Transformer Yard at the start of next week, on tomorrow's episode. And we'll carry on our way. Thank you very much for watching. I've been Jackson Tyler of AbnormalMapping.com. Tune in next time for more Alan Wake. Goodbye. <laughs>